We're going to get to the end of uh, section three here by playing through some jams using chords in keys. So check this out. Uh, on uh, page 21, I've got some play along tracks give, mm, playing through a one, four, five, one chord progression. So we're going to play it in the key of C, one, and let's put let's put the pinky on the left hand on C. It can be up here or it can be down here, but put the pinky on C. Now let's go up to F, and you can do like your middle finger probably on F. See that left hand middle finger, and then index on G. C now. We're in the key of C, which is all white notes. One, four, and five. One, two, three, four, five. If you go up that key, one, two, three, four, five, we're going to go one, four, five, and back to one. All right, I've got my jam up here. One, four, five, jam in C. One, four, five, one, jam in C. And I'm going to play it along with that. One, two, three, here we go. So the track is playing a broken chord pattern. Let's try it in another key. So our next key here is uh, one four five one jam in A. So I'm going to pull that up here in my uh, music player on Google. Here it comes. A D E with your left hand. Remember your shapes. for the same keys, for the same chords, same shape for, the, for all the chords. But we're in the key of A flat. So that means one, four, five, one. I really want you to get your brain around that. One, four, five, one. All right, here it comes. I'm just going to start with, with broken chords. Left hand doesn't 
So there's your three jams on page 21, and that really culminates uh, this chapter. All right, so you've learned, uh, let's see, you've learned about reading chord symbols and about Roman numerals, about uh, correlating diatonic chords to the Roman numeral analysis, so one, four, five, um, playing chord progressions using the one, four, five uh, chords not only in the key of C, but in the key of A and the key of A flat. So chord symbols, Roman numerals, in the key, diatonic, and key signature. Uh, and there's several assignments. So I also think uh, along with those assignments, really in this chapter, you should start to work on scales from addendum one in the, uh, in the workbook. So, happy practicing, rock on, see you in section four.